When it's all said and done, 22 World War II era murals will line this hangar behind me. And for local Prineville artist Glenn Ness, it's a massive job with each mural taking about a week to complete. But he's done 10 and he's currently working on number 11. And I thought what we were going to do, a couple of doors, but it ended up being a whole bank of doors. So it's growing as we go. I'm learning more historically about World War II planes and their development. The backgrounds on all of these are just unbelievable. It feels like you are in the air flying. Jeannie Zerbe had an idea. She wanted to make her airport hangars less blasé, as she put it. So she contracted Prineville artist Glenn Ness and gave him one main guideline. She had an idea for just the, the Allied and U.S. planes only, and that's the only stipulation she put on me. She, let, she gave me a few books that had some uh, history, started with a few drawings, and she loved them. And after a while, after she saw the first two, she just let me go. And go Glenn did, painting mural after mural and completely transforming those blasé brown hangers into a work of art. It's kind of exciting. And it's not to be real showy. Uh, you cannot really see it from the highway, but if you're a pilot and you fly in, you're gonna see it and you're gonna appreciate it. It gives you a challenge, but I love working large. I could not be prouder. And uh, to see the results, yes, I'm thrilled. Absolutely thrilled. In Prineville, Eric Lindstrom, Central Oregon Daily News.